Good morning. How y'all doing this morning? Um, I haven't been putting out any videos because I hurt my back. Can't do nothing. But today I'm changing out my dishwasher. And Ethan, my nephew, over there, way over there, he's going to be doing the work. So this is the dishwasher that, that I'm changing out. It's a Frigidaire. It broke on me. And I have another one here that I'm replacing it with. And this is Ethan. This is, say hello. Hi. Hi. And so, let me get my light. So the first thing we gotta do, we gotta turn the water off and unplug it and turn turn the water off take the hose off and then undo the drain over here that's the drain the water going to it and we're going to start that in a second okay so Ethan is going to be doing the work because I'm hurting, I can't. See that hose? You gotta follow that. That's going that that goes to your hot water. So the first thing you gotta do, you gotta turn that valve off. Sure. So you gotta turn it clockwise. That one? Yeah, that one. Right. Turn it, yeah. Turn it till you can't you can't go anymore. Make sure it's tight, tight, tight. Right? Yeah. Okay, now get your wrench and you gotta unscrew the hose. See where that hose hooks on to? Okay. So you gotta get that and push down with it, go down. Keep going. I'm afraid Pull it I'm down. Break it. No, uh -uh, you're not gonna break it, just keep going down. Pull it down hard. There you go, see? Uh, now take it out and then keep turning and let me get something to catch the water put that under there put that pot move your hose and put it under it there you go that's good now unscrew it Take it all the way off. So, you turn your valve off and you unscrew your hose. Okay, you got the hose off. You put it in a little pan. Now in case any water leaks out. So now we gotta take the drain off. So get your screwdriver. You got one of these multiple screwdrivers where you take the tips out and all that has different side nut drivers. And you got to unscrew your clamp right there. Yeah, righty tighty, lefty loosey. Hole. Oh, yeah, keep going. Don't take it off. Oh, that's good. Don't take it off all the way. Can you grab the clamp and move it, slide it down? The, the clamp. Yeah, just pull that. And pull the whole thing off. Just wiggle back and forth. And grab, grab the hose, grab the black hose and turn it and pull off. There you go, now put it in the thing. Okay. So that's all. Let your water drain out and take your clamp off because we, we're going to use that again remove the clamp, just pull it off pull it, just pull it off, right? boom, that's it okay, so okay, so now we got the water off we got the water, we turn the water off disconnect the hose go into the dishwasher and then we disconnected the drain so the next thing we got to do, 
is we gotta open the door to the dishwasher. You gotta move though. Gotta open it all the way down. And you gotta take the drill and I put some screws under here to hold the dishwasher. Okay. That's what it lifts. So see the, see the screws there? You gotta take them off. Well, this is a white Huh? Yeah. You gonna sell this dishwasher? No, throwing it away is no good. So I got screws, hold up. I got screws here, one there and one there. And when you pull it, just go uh -uh, like this. See them? Let me show you real quick. So you can just go like that, okay? Put it straight like that, and now hold it there and pull the trigger. Push up now. Push it up. There you go. Go ahead. Use both hands if you have to. We need that screw, so don't lose it. Give it there. Now you gotta come do this other one. So take your other screw off. Get to the yeah, get to that side. Come on here. Okay. You're holding your drill crooked. It's real because Hold it's coming like up in the angle. Yeah. Hold it like that, see? And then do it. There you go. Alright. Okay, now grab your screw. Grab your screw. Oh, don't lose it. Oh, shit. So we need we need them again now put it over there with the other one see what the other one the wrench okay so so now um take your drill off put it on top so we should just be able to pull it out okay so grab the door grab by both sides and kind of just kind of pull out there you go see yeah pull it out there you go okay Hold up. Now, you gotta feed your hose through here. That way, don't get all uh, tight, wound up. Okay. Now pull it. You pull. Pull it out. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. So, just pull it out. What's going to drop? The Why is it going to drop? Oh. No, just keep pulling. Okay. Stop. So now, come on this side and pull your, pull that hose out. Just pull it. Push it, push it through. Okay. Now, put it. Hey, give it. Let's put it in the dishwasher right now. Now, do you do your other thing with your drain? You got to pull your drain out. Make sure it don't get hooked. So, pull it. Pull. Okay. So now we gotta unplug the electrical. So see the electrical wire? Yeah. We gotta unplug that. So that's in this drawer. You see outlet up in there? Yeah. See it down there? Unplug it. Okay, and now push it through that hole. Okay. Okay, now pull it out. Close the door and pull it out. There you go. Okay, so now we're going to use this again oh, for the other one. So we got to disconnect it. Okay. So, so dust your dishwasher out. That's the wire. There's your space. What? Do you want me to take the wire out? Yeah, get, get, yeah we'll get to that. Okay. So there's your space. That's the dishwasher. So now I've got a couple of towels. 
and I want to lay this down so that I can disconnect the the electrical. Make it easier that we don't have to crawl up under it. Or Ethan doesn't have to crawl under it. So we gotta we're on on doing the water line. So you can use a pair of these little channel locks or or this kind of channel locks. Whatever kind you you have. Hey, that's you. Put it on there and unscrew it. Is it turning? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. Pray with your hand. Do it with your hand now. Okay. Okay. Put it in the pot. Now, now leave, leave it there and get your hose and take it up and stretch it up tall. Make sure it don't go to the part that you drain all the water out, out of it. Okay, all the water drained out. Now take it down, put it over there somewhere. Okay, that's good. Put it in the thing on the tile. That way in case any water come out, don't it doesn't um, go on the floor. Now clean wipe up the um water, move your pot, and wipe it up good. Make sure no water on the floor. Okay, that's good. So there you go. Now we gotta undo the electrical. So we gotta see where that is coming out, going into. So that's going into our front. Okay. So we brought it outside because um, once we took the water line off, it started leaking on the floor. So I brought it outside. So now we gotta take the electrical off. So we gotta unscrew these two screws. So get your drill. And that one, but well, it doesn't matter which one. Put your drill out. So that's, this comes out and that comes out. And here's your electrical. So we gotta open it. So we gotta get your drill and we gotta take this one screw off here. Hold it on the top, push down. Hold on, wait, stop. Get your screwdriver. Take this thing out, pull that out. That's too big, so you gotta flip it around. Pull the whole thing out. Wait, no, that's a star, that's why. So I had to use a little, a little um, nut driver on one of the other sides of the um, screwdriver. Take it off. Take the pan out. Take the cover off. There you go. Okay. So now you gotta unscrew. So yeah, I just put it there. So you gotta unscrew, unscrew these, like. Unscrew them. Okay. Now get your nut and we gotta loosen this. That all. You get, use your fill, fill it. Spin it around. Hold on. Okay, now unscrew it. Okay, there you go, take the screw off. Now what you want to do is grab grab the wires, well one at a time, that's, that's coming from your thing, grab it here, and just pull on it, pull it loose. Just pull, see? Now do the other one the same way. Pull it out, you can pull it out. Yeah, and then do the, that one the same thing. Just, there you go. Now I got a little um little cap and a wire go goes through. So now the way these work, you just push them in with a screwdriver. So turn it. There you go. Now do that one. There you go. Now do that one. There you go. Is it well? Pull it out. 
Okay, so we need this wire, so you gotta collect the wire. Put your screw, no, go through the air, and then get it out, because it's stuck in the d door. There you go, so we need that. Okay. So this one is all disconnected. We are using our cord and the wall is off. So this ready to throw away. So let's go inside and we'll start setting the, the other one up. Okay, we're doing the same thing. We're gonna um, take your top off. And wait, push down on the top of your drill and go easy, slow. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, there, loose. Do this one. Okay, take that one out. Take that off. Put your drill down. Right, take that off. There you go. Come on. Take it off. Put it, put it on top of here. Pick that up and do the same thing. So we're doing the same thing with this. See, we got on. Don't worry about that. We gotta take that screw off. Okay. So, so the screw, hold on. The screw that holds this box on right here, that's a star screw. I screw off to take the box off, then we'll hook up the electrical. So unscrew that. Hold your drill straight, straight up and down. That's it. Take it top off. So there's a the wire. So you pull this wire out, put your drill up, sit, sit, drill down. Where's the cord? Grab your cord. Okay. Come over here. So this, you want to take this and just shove it up through here. So it clips twice. Put, get all your wires in first. Wires through first and push it up. Push, push some more. Okay, keep, 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 push push you know all the way through huh yeah okay now you are and wrap this around your ground the green is for your ground right. get your um, drill uh, tighten this screw you gotta flip your thing now see okay go easy so all it straight up and down and, and go okay. okay stop so that's tight okay so now you straighten these wires out and you want to get your your blanking thing hold this and you want it a little longer I'm not sure you want to take a little bit off of one that way you got some room Nope, it's turned off. Okay. So now you want to take your wires and push them through here. Make sure they don't they're not hooked up on, on nothing. Push them through. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Now yeah. You wanna connect them now. How do you think they go? Uh black to white. <laughs> <laughs> black to black, white to white. Always match your colors with when it comes to electrical. So no get go down like this. Hold it hold I'll show you. Touch the screen. So you wanna take it and you wanna kinda just thread it on, you know? And if you want you want op open it up a little bit and you turn it like that and then you put your wire nut. Make sure no wire is sticking through your wire nut. Sticking past your wire nut. No bare wire. Okay, put it on there tight. Okay, now I think you do the other one. Hmm. Or you want me to do this one too? Um, you want to try it? Yeah. So put them even, like see your rubber. And you open them up. And then you just 
Now you hold in each one and you thread it good. Right. You, you try it now. And I'm even. There you go. And then kind of thread it. Let's see what you got. There you go. Okay. There's your wire nut. Now put your wire nut on there. Still hold your wire down low. You know, and then put your wire nut on and tighten it up good tight just turn it tighten it up i guess you don't have to hold the wire just tighten it up righty tidy lefty loosey you're going to go clockwise tighten it counterclockwise to loosen it so this one that's loosening it oh. that's counterclockwise turn it to your right There we go. It's on tight, tight. You make sure when you do it, hold it, hold the thing. And you hold it down good. And you make sure it's tight. On it, tight, tight. Okay? So that's that. So you gotta get your box. And you're gonna put your box on. You gotta so loosen it and tighten it. Alright, try it. That's tighten it. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. That's good, stop. Okay, so now the electrical is on. So you want to take your electrical and pass it through here. Like that. Okay, now we need our water hose. Grab our water hose, it's in the laundry room. Make sure it's, it's straight. You hold it. Make sure that you make sure it has a gasket in there. Is it on? Let's see. See, make sure your gasket to the rubber black ga gasket. Make sure that's in there. Now it's going to leak. Okay. And make sure you got it on because you you screw it on to plastic and that will um, cross thread real easy. Make sure it goes on real easy, okay? If it starts getting hard, like real soon, then it's um, it's cross-threading. So you need the wrench the way you took the other one off. So grab that wrench. So now you wanna grab it and tighten it up. So this one. Go, yeah, go to your right. Hey, let's see. Make sure it's there. You go. Make sure it's tight. Now. Hey, let's see. Stop. Stop. Give me the thing. Okay. Oh, you got it on. That one. Make sure it's very tight because you don't want it leaking. So that's tight. And this is tight because it came off the old one. So that I know. So move this out the way and we gotta stand it up. What I do, I make sure all of my um my water line, my drain, and my power is coming through the back of it. Cause they're going to go into these holes well okay so now you're going to take and push it close to the hole the way it goes so just push it there you go push push a little more that's good so now tilt it like this you gotta come on this side come over here and this is your drain and your drain goes into the top hole see i got a hole up on the top to that hole yeah that push that put that through that hole push it as much as you can uh, as far as you can go okay, okay now get your water line sit right there see your water line look down there push it through the bottom hole there you go 
push as far as you can. Nah, there you go. Okay. So now you gotta do your electrical now. You gotta push it a little closer. Look. You got you wanna keep it on a little angle so you can get in there to push it into the hole. So a little angle. Uh oh, uh oh. There you go. Don't plug it in yet now. So you want to push the dishwasher in. Okay? Push it in a little bit. Straighten it out. Get it right in the middle of the hole. Don't pull it too much. Then you pull your cord out. Push it in. Close that door. Right now. You want to push it in a little bit. Now you want to pull on your hoses. That way they don't get tangled up. You pull on your water hose, pull it till it goes tight. Don't, okay. Okay, see, it's right here, see? Okay, that's good. Now pull your other one. Okay. Okay, that's good. Now you want to push it in. Make easy now, make sure it goes in even and you're not, not hitting nothing. Yeah, look, you're hitting down here, see? That's your bottom. Try to go over a little bit, make sure you're in the hole now. Now pull on your electrical. Pull on your electrical a little bit. Probably that don't get tiny. Just pull it, don't plug it in. Just pull on it. Pull as much as you can. Here you go. Okay, now push it in. There you go. Push it in. Okay. There you go. Now, I gotta get a level and we gotta make sure it's level before we hook it up. Yeah. So let me. So, what you do to level, level it, you gotta open the door. Open your door, just pull on it. But you're pulling the whole thing, so. Pull, there you go. Bring it all the way down. Okay. You gotta take this out. Grab, pick it up, take it out. Put it over there. Put it somewhere. Get out of the way. Okay, there you go. Now. You gotta take the level and you gotta put it across the door right here. Sit it on the door and look at your bubble. The way your bubble, make sure your bubble's in between them two lines. Yep. So the bubble's in between the two lines mm -hmm. and then you put it on that over here. See, on this, cross that way or do it on that one. Push it all the way back. Put it on there. How that looks? That looks good, perfect. Yeah. Okay, so you're good. Okay, I'll set the level down. So now we gotta find those holes that we put up in here. So let's get the light. Lay it down, I guess. Put it here. Well, there's those two screws. You need your drill. Grab your drill. Drill on top. Bring it here. We gotta change that, swap all that out. Hold on. So we're putting them in, tight now and now. I push this down. Huh? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, here we go. There you go. Okay. You come do your other side. Okay. You got it? That's good. So take the light out. Okay, so now we gotta hook the water back up. Okay, put the light under the cabinet. So, where's the drain? Way down here. The water, pull the water. It has to reach. No, you gotta go the same way you, you did on through here and 
through that. And then it has to screw onto that. Okay, we got it uh, started now. You got to turn up, not down. Okay, and then you're gonna tighten it up. Start from down first, start all the way down. Bring your wrench all the way down. All there you go. Then turn spin it all the way up. Pull it off and then do the same thing. Do that until it's tight. So the water is on. Now we gotta do your drain. Come over here, get your drain. Now push it into the hole, push the access in. Okay, now grab your hose. No, put it up above that. Oh, go over that. There you go. Now take your clamp and put it on this. Put it on here. You might have to loosen up a little bit. Loosen your clamp up. Here, pull that out. Pull that tip out. Now grab your clamp and you want counter go this way. Okay. Okay, now push it on. Put it on. Spin your clamp around though. That was facing you easier to screw on. There you go, just put it on there. Now you want to push it on there. There you go, just, just like that. Bring your clamp in. Bring clamp forward, you go on this fat ass hit right there. Perfect, right there. Now tighten it. Left? Mm -hmm. And you're turning this way, clockwise. Put the screwdriver down. We don't need it right now. Set it down somewhere. And you gotta come and turn the water on. So you gotta turn it counterclockwise. Turn it on all the way till it stops. Till it's tight. Tight. Is it tighten it tight? Okay, that's good. Okay, so now we plug it in. So you gotta come in this cabinet and you need a light? No, I got it. So Plug it in. Is it in? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's take all the paper off. We need the scissors to cut that hole. Hold up. Yeah, take all that off. Pick that up. Throw it out of the way. Now, put that in there. Put your thing back in there. You just roll it in. There you go. Roll it in. Now, your drain is on, that's tight. Your water is on, that's tight, and you turn the water on. Your power is on. So let's close the door. Close it. Push it in the middle. Okay, see so it's on. So you want to hit start. Okay. Now we gotta look up under here, get the flashlight, get that flashlight. Look, look at me, see that flashlight? And shine under there to make sure it is not leaking. Nothing is leaking. Nothing leaking? No, not yet. Not yet? Nope. Okay, so let's let it run. And then every once in a while we'll check it. Okay. Like when, it's, when it starts draining, then we'll check that to make sure that um, the drain works good. Okay, so nothing is leaking up on it there as well. Okay, turn your light off. Turn this light off over here. Click it again. Click. Okay, sit it down. So. Okay, we're gonna um, let it run run through a cycle before we put our kick plate on I will make sure that there is no leaks so we're going to put the little kick plate on I don't know if you can see it but there's the kick plate and uh, we check for leaks there weren't any leaks it's still running but it already drained and all that so Ethan is going to finish um, 
putting a little kick plate on. Tighten the screws up. So I tighten them up. So just turn it easy, just go slow. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Okay. The other one. That's good. Okay, so oh Jesus, there it is. How do I install a dishwasher or replace a dishwasher? Well, either so we don't have any leaks, and the dishwasher is good. So now we're taking the blue plastic off. The best thing. The easiest way to do it is cut cut along your sides and then your top and it'll peel off a lot easier. So peel it off, finish peeling it off. And you just peel it off. There you go. Yeah. So this is how to replace a dishwasher. I hope this helps. You know, God bless and thank you all. Thank you, Ethan. You're